your grace, what is the basis of your teachings? The basis of this teaching is uh, Bhagavad Gita as it is. And I have already published my book, uh, this Bhagavad Gita as it is. This book is not new. It is very old book, at least five thousand years old, and it is uh, very widely read all over the world. Uh, in your country, I have seen there are about um, more than twenty-five different editions in this. Uh, similarly, uh, there is in German language, in, in England, in Japan, everywhere, all over the country, this book is very widely known, uh, <coughs> Bhagavad Gita. In other words, uh, this is Krishna consciousness. Uh, the speaker of this book is Lord Krishna. And The subject matter of this book is what is our relationship with God. Then, after understanding what is our relationship with God, we can work accordingly. Just like you are citizen of America, you have got a particular relationship with the state and you are expected to work according to that relationship, then you are good citizen, you are law-abiding citizens and state gives you all protection and you can improve to the highest perfectional state. Similarly, if we know our relationship with God, whom we call Krishna. And Krishna means all attract. And, and that is the perfect name of God. Unless God is all attractive, He cannot be God. God cannot be Hindu's God or Christian's God a Jew's God, a Mohammedan's God. No. God is for everyone. And He is all attract. He is, he is uh, fully opulent. He is fully uh, in knowledge, perfect in knowledge, perfect in beauty, perfect in renunciation, perfect in fame, perfect in strength. In this way he is all attract. So we must know our relationship with God. That is the first subject matter of this book, Bhagavad Gita, as it is. Then if we understand our relationship, we can act accordingly. Uh, at the present moment, we are, some of us, uh, a declining God. There is no God. Uh, some of them have little conception of God. God is great, but uh, they do not try to understand what is actual relationship with God. They are not very serious. In this way, uh, practically, we are avoiding our eternal relationship with God, and therefore we cannot act properly. And that is the cause of all miseries. That is the cause of all problems. Just like if we do not know uh, the state laws, uh, then you do not act properly. You are always criminal. 
for example, if you do not know how to drive, keep to the right, if you drive left,